wine and stuff. Mayor Moreau Weinberger, very happy to be making this announcement tonight. As you mentioned, this is an issue the city has been grappling with for years. Closing the final chapter in a decade long financial struggle. The city has made good on our promise to resolve the Burlington Telecom crisis. Burlington officially approved the sale of Burlington Telecom to Shures Communications. Mayor Mara Weinberger calling it a step towards regaining the city's financial health, which took a hit years ago after millions of dollars in taxpayer money was spent to keep the struggling telecom afloat. City Council voted unanimously in 2014 for the settlement agreement that set us on the trajectory to getting to today, and they voted 11 to 1 in the final vote on uh, Monday night uh, to take this final step. Weinberger says the deal will improve the city's credit rating and recover the money spent to keep Burling Telecom up and running. It also fully releases the city from a $33.5 million lawsuit with Citibank, which had loaned BT money when it was city owned. Not everyone is happy about the completed sale. A group of six men and women from Burlington who wanted BT to be sold to a local group plan on filing an appeal to the Supreme Court. In a statement to NBC5, they said in part, this is not a day of celebration as the mayor would like us to believe. Due to this administration's refusal to stay true to the community's wishes, taxpayers are now out millions of dollars with no chance of recouping investments in Burlington Telecom. Profits from Burlington Telecom should rightfully remain in Burlington, not shipped to Indiana. Now, in response to that citizens group filing an appeal, Mara Weinberger says he is very confident in the city's decision. He believes there's virtually no chance of the Supreme Court uh, undoing this transaction. For now, live in Burlington tonight, Helena Batapaglia, NBC5 News.